1900s, India was awakened by a saintly man from Sabarmati to free itself from colonialism. Today, India is awakened once again by a simple common man to free itself from the dirt of corruption. Well, he taught us that not only the common people but even students like us can contribute towards anti-corruption and make our country a better place. He is a striking reminder of the power of people and how each of us has the potential to bring about a tremendous change in the future of the country. I think it will be a great opportunity if we have the chance to meet with him and interact with him. I'm glad that he is visiting us at the University of Maryland and I'm very eager to hear him. Yeah, definitely it's a great opportunity to meet uh, Padma Bhushan Anna Hazare and especially when he is coming to our own University of Maryland College Park. Anna Hazare is one of the few people who successfully inspired the youth like us. The historic movement led by him against the corruption in India has brought about tremendous change in the society. I find myself blessed to be in an era of Anna Hazare where after the revolution of Gandhi, first time have we ever seen such a public participation for the development of our country India. Anna Hazare is the face of anti-corruption movement in India. It is because of him that the common man has realized his power. I am excited not only because of uh, Anna's social uh, contributions to developing a model village uh, which is called Adarsh Gaos in Maharashtra um, and also the India Against Corruption movement but also because he uh, is a living example of uh, who is living the values of Swami Vivekananda and being this being the 150th birth anniversary of Swami Vivekananda and because Anna's life has been so much influenced by the message of Swami Vivekananda so I think that is one, one unique thing which uh, Anna Hazare has inspired not just me, but so many of my friends. When I hear of Anna Hazare, the first thing that pops up to my mind is the biggest social reform movement of the world that I have seen. Millions of people have joined him in the march against corruption. I am proud that I have been a part of this fight. He has made every citizen realize their worth in building this nation. I am looking forward to interact with Anna on August 22nd in the University of Maryland. I cannot say how honored I feel to be interacting with someone who is striving relentlessly for this just and selfless cause. I'm really excited to receive this once in a lifetime opportunity and I would never miss it. We are highly honored to be under his guidance in such an historical step. Jai Hind. Jai Hind. Jai Hind. Jai Hind. Jai Hind.